All right, good morning. So it's Tuesday, July the 23rd, and there is Goober packing up camp for the last time. He, uh, he's getting off trail Thursday, going back, getting started doing his own thing. He's had enough of the Appalachian Trail for the year. Um, I think he plans on doing the parts he missed later. But gonna be another hot day today. We only have how many miles we got today, Goo? Nine point seven. Yeah, we have about nine point seven to uh, North Adams. And that's where Details' wife's gonna pick us up. We're gonna go into go to Details' house through the holidays. So we'll miss Goober, and he starts out today with. Uh, one green sock, one brown sock. Way to go, Goo. <laughs> Did you plan that? Yeah, my other green one had a hole in it. I couldn't find the brown one. <laughs> yeah, nobody cares. So, that's the way it is. Uh, well, that's all we got for now. I'm finished loading my pack. And we'll hit the trail. So here is the highest point in Massachusetts, top of Mount Gray Lock. Have a beautiful tower up here. Here's Detail walking up. He's from Massachusetts, but we've never been up here. So it's a two hour drive from his house and he ends up walking four months and 1600 miles instead to get here. So. Elevation 3491. We'll go up in the tower. Oh man, that is nice. He saw me up here in the window. <laughs> 
Come in details up in the tower and Goober's walking around. <laughs> he saw me waving at me. He saw me really cool filming and he was waving up here at me. <laughs> So there's a look at uh, Williamstown. What are those mountains over there, Detail? Do you know? Finally starting to see some big mountains again. All right, we're one mile from the parking lot where we're, um, Detail's wife's gonna pick us up. Uber's last mile on the AT for the year. <clears throat> it's been a long downhill coming off Mount Greylock. And I'd be glad to get to the bottom. Get something cold to drink. Be off the trail for a few days. I got a lot of videos to upload. So I'll be busy doing that, grilling out, hanging out by the pool, just relaxing a little bit for a few days. Yeah. Uber's last mile. I think he's looking forward to getting home. <clears throat> he, uh, he thought about going home. Uh, from uh, Wingdale, New York, decided he would uh, push on, stay with us till Austin. Just got him over his thousand mile mark. And uh, not quite half the trail, but very close to getting half the trail done. I don't know, hadn't totaled it up yet how many trail miles he'll end up with for the year, but right at half. Definitely over a thousand miles, so good job for Goober. After our long holiday weekend, me in detail, we'll hit the trail probably on Sunday, and uh, we're headed for Katad. Going to get that picture. We're also going to We'll be saying goodbye to a lot of the trail family we've had from the beginning, us getting off the trail for that many days. They'll be 100 miles or so ahead probably. So we lost a good chunk of the ones that we've been hiking with through this whole trip. Kind of sad, but I mean, that's just, that's just the way the trail works. People come and go we get back on trail we'll probably see people that we've passed and hiked ahead of so won't be totally new faces there'll be a lot of people that we've already hiked with and some new ones so you never know you just take it as it comes people come and go on the trail and we may catch some of the ones that we're leaving now again funny how that works but that's it for now. Let's get on down the hill. All right, so we just come out of the woods down into the town of North Adams. Hot, man, it's hot. Basically walking across this concrete. I don't know if you can see way up there in front of us. Another one of our trail buddies, Jinx. He's in town, he has no idea we're behind him. And he was in the woods, we had no idea he was in front of us. That's kind of the way it goes. You think you're in the middle of the woods all by yourself and 
and they turn the corner and run into five people. So he's been, he's pretty much been in front of us all day and we had no idea. He still don't know we back here. But, that's the way it is. Anyway, we headed to a parking lot down here. Not sure. It's a great lock school, I guess. I don't know if it's a high school or what. You got a playground, so don't. I don't guess it's a high school. Anyway, this day's about over. We're about to get that break. Hate like heck to see Goober go, but he's ready to get off trail. He's 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 had his AT experience. Says he may finish it one day. He may not. You know, and that's on him. That's. Whatever he prefers, I'm not putting any pressure on him either way. Uh, it's been great hiking with him. Enjoyed him coming back. I don't know how many miles we've done since he's been back. I hadn't calculated it up, I would say. Uh, I would say around 400 maybe. 400 additional miles. Something like that. We'll, we'll add it up and put it in, put it in this goodbye video. <clears throat> but that's it for now.